You will not believe it, but did you know Roy Hodgson departs Crystal Palace as an undebatable club legend and football legend. Following 200 games over six seasons, the Croydon-born one of their own has stepped down, with fans of the beautiful game amassing to celebrate a true great. Eagles owner Steve Parrish has stated Hodgson has the keys to Selhurst Park, a beautiful testament to his exceptional services at the South London Club. His career is truly remarkable, from Halmstad's BK of Sweden to Italian giants Internazionale, ever present in the Premier League, managing the likes of Blackburn Rovers, Fulham, Liverpool, West Brom, Watford, and Crystal Palace. The England gaffer from May 2012 until June 2016, spanning over two European Championship tournaments and the World Cup in Brazil, a Danish champion with FC Copenhagen, a four times Swedish champion, two times with Halmstad's BK, and two times with Malmo FF. No manager was ever a mismatch either. Johan Cruyff was defeated. Sir Alex Ferguson, Arsene Wenger, and Pep Guardiola lost at his expense too. A CV that is not only incredibly unique, but also outrageously impressive in regards to longevity at the highest level. One of a kind. One of his best achievements is undoubtedly leading Fulham to the UEFA Cup final, only to be runners-up at the expense of European mammoths Atletico Madrid. No shame in that. The journey to the final was exceptional, putting Juventus to the sword 4-1 at Craven Cottage to advance. A night cottagers will never forget. A box office clash for the neutral. Andy Johnson, Bobby Zamora, Damian Duff, and Breda Hangeland were four prime examples of signings that showed Hodgson knew how to do business. The streets won't forget that Fulham side established. Last season, Hodgson was to thank for single-handedly saving top-flight status. After returning for his second stint, the gaffer steadied the ship incredibly well at the business end of the 22-23 season. Returning to the dugout, Palace were in need desperately, and Roy delivered with three consecutive wins, including a 5-1 thrashing at Elland Road, defeating a relegation rival in the process. This steered Palace clear of the relegation battle, enabling comfortable survival.